Aku Ratu. He's had a terrific season down in Tucson. Puck is played and a shot by Valamaki is gobbled up by Calvin Pickard. And I've been in this situation before. It's always tough to get up for these games. Now back out high. Troy Stetcher, the former Coyote, out there defensively for Edmonton. Sent one in behind the net, and it goes to the front where it's covered. Step, and that really didn't happen this year for this group like they wanted it to, but baby steps, you'll take it. And I'll tell you what, we've talked a lot about the young talent on this group. The Michellis, the Josh Doan, the Dylan Gunthers, the Logan Cooleys. And they score! How about that look? one nothing. It's a career high for him and goals, and... This is what he always does. Lays the body. Big hit there on the side boards. And he wasn't done there. A quick snap. A wrangle and a glove of Ficker. That is an absolute ripper of a shot. Just walks right into that one. And no one home for the Edmonton Oilers at all. Almost a 2-3 on 0 for the Coyotes. Into the corner. Cutting in behind the net. Brown out high. Brover going to stop there. Connor Ingram. He played in behind the net. Matias Sackholm and around now. And Bouchard will move it out for Ryan Nugent Hopkins. Dry Seidel and Fogel on this line as well. And a oh. shot off the piper is it in? Oh, They're oh, saying that's... it's in. I don't know. That full line. We have no goal. Well, they're loving it here at the Moulet. Nugent Hopkins and now to Bouchard and they work it around. McDavid. Nugent Hopkins across. Dreisaitl challenged that time and Connor Ingram. Get this puck. Great read. Anticipation by Connor Ingram. And this is all about preparation. Squares up to that puck. No hole. Sticks away the lower part of the net. And more for Dreisaitl but to fire it. He tries to open up the mattress through the five hole but Connor Ingram having nothing to do with it. And the Coyotes get it clear, or get it killed, excuse me. McLeod to the front and stopped again, Connor Ingram. Into the corner and right back to the front. Dreisaitl fanned on it. Leon Dreisaitl back out high over to Eckholm. Right to the front, they score. Back to the D-man. Right here by Dreisaitl. D to D and watch Carrick just come right into the picture. Stick on the ice, the redirection and... So difficult for the Coyotes defenseman to pick up. You want to front the shot. You want to block it. Kesselring is caught up with the Anmark in front as well. And that leaves Carrick all alone. Side of the net. No chance. And a quick counter here. Holloway brings it in. Holloway to the front. Stop. Oh, what a stop. Connor Ingram. Here tonight in Connor Ingram in the second. Razor sharp for the Coyotes. I just have uh, more depth these days in their goaltending pipeline. They got uh, Michael Horabo from UMass had a real good season. Uh, Bouchard and his shot whistles wide. Hyman. Oh, Hyman just rocked Connor yeah. Ingram. But here's the shot by Bouchard that was almost point number 82. There. Ratu. And now Carconi. Carconi to the forehand. And Pickard able to keep it out. Well, Michael Carconi has been terrific all season long. Almost had another. A little drop here, McLeod to the front. Stopped by Connor Ingram. Now the Coyotes will bring it along. Lead pass, Michelli is in. Michelli scores! Matias Michelli! Look at this pass though. The game just rips this one. And Michelli knocks this right out of midair. Hand-eye coordination, then the finish, forehand and a backhand. Could have knocked that puck right down. That would have went all the way down for icing. Instead, he's on a partial breakaway, settles this puck down. And tip suffocating in the neutral zone, forcing dump ins. This is the top line of the Everton Oilers as well. To the front and nearly put home dry saddle. That was Brown that he works. Absolutely fitting, right? And again, Shane don't leaves and so does the team potentially. Gunther will bring it in. 
Little drop, Cole Achona to the front, Kraus, he scores! Lawson Kraus! 23rd of the season, it's 3-1. One of the foot soldiers for this Coyotes group. Another great year for him. And he doesn't miss from there. Nice set of hands on him for a big man. 6'4", 220. It shouldn't be able to move like that. Sneaks in behind everyone. And tucks that one past picker. The glove side, the exact same spot that Josh Stone races it back. Three on two, going wide, Carcone to the front. O'Brien almost had his second of the night. Broberg out for Warren Fogel. Well, Fogel with a shot, he scores. Barred down, Warren Fogel, and it's 3-2. Backs off the Coyotes defenders, that's Valimaki. Cuts to the middle of the ice and draws a, a screen to him and just beats Connor Ingram clean on that one. I'm not sure if that went off the stick of Valimaki or not. We'll get a better look at it here. And I think this might just go straight in over the glove of Ingram. And you're right, bar down. And Pickard got a piece. What a save by Pickard. That was labeled. One shot now in this Coyotes power play. And down low it goes. Keller. Across. Gunther. Shoots. He scores! Dylan Gunther! Do we, do we have to say it again? This is why you get excited. Players, the young talent, just turned 21 on that last road trip. He missed the first one that was labeled. He's not going to miss again. This time he goes the other side. Top glove, and that is top cheese right there. Post it in. What a pass by Clayton Keller. And Gunther walks that one in a little bit closer and just rips it. Back out high, intended for McDavid. Ekholm's playing it. And he brings it around for Dreisaitl. So extra attacker out, offensive zone. Ekholm with a shot, stopped. And all the way down and in. Sean Dersey. You don't need me talking over this. I'm just going to, I'm going to let it go. Drag people out of this rink. I'm eh? pretty sure about that. And nobody's leaving. We're also going to salute this crowd here tonight at Mullet Arena. The entire group, and they're going to take a picture here. Oh, wow. It's amazing. How about that? That is an amazing staff right there. I'll tell you what. If they're going to Salt Lake. Ryan Smith is getting one heck of a group. Some serious young talent. Something that you can build something really special.